So just a couple pieces of food here, just let the dog have them. And, th and what I'm looking for, and you don't have to move so much, just kind of stand there. Let's just watch the dog take the food, good. And then what does the dog do? Okay, so the dog's taking food and looking at her expectantly. So then you're ready to start marking the focus. So instead of putting your hand down, so you're dropping your hand before, and you're standing here when the dog's looking at you, say yes and then move to feed. That was hand first and then a yes. Yes first, yes and then move. There we go, right? That's a really common one. People start to wind up to deliver the reward before they do. So the dog's looking at them, they start to drop their hand and then they say yes, right? But if you do that, as soon as you start to drop your hand, the dog starts to transfer the focus to your hand, and so you say yes at the moment they're breaking off focus, right? And instead of, there we go, good. Now, that's good, the dog's doing well. Those were all one stop, one stop, one stop. So sometimes yes, one, two, three. Right? Do multiple, sometimes yes, one, stop. The other thing she's doing is she's rewarding every time, right to the right side of her leg, the same every time, right? So again, from an engagement perspective, that's not necessarily a big problem, right? But if I do that long term, everything's gonna be on her right side. So they're all right side delivery and all to the side of her body. So if she were to try to have the dog sit in front of her, the dog's gonna sit crooked facing her right side. So it doesn't affect this part of it, but it will affect behavior creation as she goes forward. Good. And then make sure you're marking when the dog's looking at you before. Now here. Yes. Good. Nice job. Good. The other thing I'd encourage is you to move your feet more. You're trying to do the work with just your arm. So instead of doing those big sweeping ones, go yes and move your feet and keep going. There you go. It's easier that way, right? So that way you can keep moving. Wait for the dog. Okay. Right, and make sure you don't drop your hand first. Just wait, and when the dog looks back, wait, and yes, there, boom, right, excellent, right? As soon as it, you're dropping your hand first though, right? So that's a biggie, right? So the dog is paying a lot of attention to her hands, right? And in the beginning, I don't really care, but as we go forward, I want my hands not to be the target, but sort of more like me. And if I start to drop my hand before I say yes, the dog starts to go towards my hand, and so I'm saying yes for them going towards my hand instead of yes for paying attention to me. So if I'm standing here and the dog's looking at me and I say yes and then move to deliver the reward, I rewarded this. If they're looking at me and I drop my hand and they start to go there and then I say yes, I said yes for breaking off from focus on me and for them go heading towards my hand. Good.